next guest is a trailblazing leader in sports. She's part of an all-female team building a professional women's soccer team. Yeah, she's making history. The team will be based out of Boston and kicks off their first season in 2026. Please welcome controlling partner of the Boston Nation Football Club, Jennifer Epstein. Good to see you. And congratulations. Thank you so much for having me here today. Uh, you know, it's great news that we're announcing. There's another sports team in the city of Boston. I know Boston fans love their sports team, so I'm sure they're going to love this team as well. It's an all-female team that is sort of spearheading this. I'm so curious, how did this all come together? Well, you know, that is, I think, really unique. We are a, a all-female uh, core leadership for our team here in Boston. And, uh, you know, I like to joke around also unique in professional sports, average height 5'1", I think, of the, <laughs> of the managing partners. You'll see them when they, when they come out in a moment. But um, yeah, you know, first and foremost, we're Bostonians. So we uh, are deeply connected to our market. And um, we have a broader investor group also deeply connected in all the key sectors to help us uh, uh, launch our founding vision and make this team a real success, embedded in the hearts and minds of the uh, people who live in Boston. I'd love to hear it. What's the outlook for women's soccer in the U.S., especially I mean, with the team kicking off in 2026? You know, it's the fastest growing league in the country. And, uh, you know, women's sports is it's a it's a movement. It's not a moment. You're seeing sold out stadiums, record breaking attendance, record viewership. So, you know, there's a hunger out there to see the women competing, you know, at the same level as the men. And in Boston, you know, we're a city with championship sports teams. Uh, we like to win. And this team, you know, we're setting this team, team up. So we bring Boston its next championship. You know, in, in Boston, what we do when we win is we ride the duck boats down Boylston Street. Mm -hmm. yes, and, you, uh, you know, we're going to do that with female athletes as the focus of the celebration. You know, when you look at women's soccer, the U.S. women's national team really spearheaded that pay equity fight. Uh, when you think about what equity looks like for these female athletes, what, what is that? Well, you know, we just um, signed a new CBA with the Players Association, and, you know, it is all about uh, ra we raise the salary cap and giving players um, more control and flexibility over where they play, aligning us, you know, with the global standard. So, um, yes, it, 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 again, the athletes that play in the NWSL, they're at the pinnacle, they're at the top of the sport, and, you know, they deserve to have the benefits and the amenities and the salaries that, you know, start to chart the course towards equity with our professional male athletes. And I love how you said it's a movement, not a moment. Absolutely. Which means you can't do it alone. So let's bring Absolutely. out some partners, some of your friends here. Stephanie Connaughton, Amy Kwan Denoff, and Anna Palmer. Let's give them a round of applause as they come out here. Oh, nice. Oh, gifts. OK, keep them coming. Nice. <laughs> Thank you. I love this. So who came up with the logo and the colors? Just curious. Well, I mean, my, my partner here, Stephanie, who is a marketer, worked years for Gillette, really spearheaded the brilliant uh, brand identity that we're rolling out. And, uh, and we partnered with a local agency. Like I said, we're really thinking about deep ties to our market and our agency Colossus, Boston Small Agency of the Year, uh, named by Adweek. So um, keeping that's where it, it came all from. local. Yeah. yeah. Well, you got two new fans here. Very Boss cool. Nation, go Boss Nation. Yay. Congratulations. Well, and mm -hmm. thank you all for joining us today. Fun, Good yeah. luck to the team. Thank you. <laughs> Come join on. us in March. And you can cheer for them when they take the field in 2026. <laughs>